Halloween, Halloween, very classic 80s metal band has been around forever and they're still putting out good quality music. So this is a video reaction to Halloween's new... Yeah, new music video for the song called Best Time. See, it's a little cartoony. Because my problem with uh, with all these bands that are, that's been around since the 80s, and they're still putting out music like Scorpions, Halloween, Iron Maiden, bands that had big hits on the radio in, in those days. Classic radio stations are only going to play their hits from the 80s. They don't want to play the new stuff. They want to play the old stuff that makes them money. They might, yeah, and if, and if they do play the new stuff, they might do it just one time, like when the album comes out, and then that's it. What we need is we need people to go back to the 80s and pick up their rotary phone and call their local radio <laughs> yeah. station and request a Song. Exactly. Yeah. I don't think people do that anymore. <laughs> That's part of the problem. Maybe I need to call this rock station here in Portland and do a different voice every time. Hey, can you play that new Halloween song? Uh, best time. Can you play Ghost? <laughs> can, can you play, play Ghost? ghost? Yeah. I need you to play Ghost. Call me Little Sunshine. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we're going to react to this video. It's the first time we're seeing it. It just came out today. And one one other thing I want to put out point out about this new video, uh, as I've seen just the thumbnail of it, it's got the singer of uh, Arch Enemy in it. Uh, in, in the actual video. So I don't know what she, the the weird thing is she's not on the song. Like if you listen to the song from the record, the original album that came out just last year. Yeah, I think she's just in the video. I think she's just like a guest appearance. Even though I got the single yesterday, I haven't heard Side 2 and there's a remix of the song Best Time, but it doesn't have her name on it. But I'm just wondering maybe she's part of the remix or something, but I haven't seen the video yet. It's just dropped today and I'm anxious to see what her, her role in the whole thing is. And All right, here we go. Halloween, Best Time. Directed by Martin Hall. Cool. Whoever that is. They always have cool videos. Well shot. Yeah. Very clean. Pumpkin. They always they love pumpkins because it's called Halloween. Yep. But you don't always have to go with that pumpkin. <laughs> yeah. That's their logo. I, <laughs> I just love the melody. Oh, I love the melody of this song. She's the queen. Is that her? Yeah. Right? It's the singer from Arch Enemy. She's the queen beast. Yeah. I gotta get up, drink a power, shirt, string in my mind. Kind of like a Billy Idol feel. I had a yeah. bad trip, gotta push myself back on the line. That's the guy from the Halloween Halloween video back in the 80s. Yes, I know I'm gonna oh, be alright. Not him, though, but the other guy from Fun Day. Oh, okay. He's bigger. Oh, he's the old singer. That's, I don't remember what they look yeah. like. Yeah, so. remember he used to have, like, long blonde hair, but now he's kind of old and fat and bald. <laughs> <laughs> Still a powerful voice, though. Yeah, I always love that voice, those vocals. Yeah. It's a good song, like a good feel-good song. Yeah. yeah, it seems very happy. Yeah. When I think of Halloween, I think of more like... Yeah, they, and they do have some, yeah, they have some of that. I have no fear, now I know there will be a mountain to climb. It's got that German accent. Yeah. Yes, I know I'm gonna be Some top notch CGI there. Right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I wonder what's the point of having her in the video. I mean. <laughs> I, like I said, they were probably on tour and they're like, hey, you want to be in the video? Yeah. We need a hot chick. Uh -huh. <laughs> Michael Keith. That is the thing. That's cool. Oh, well, I'm part of the club. They have one song on the new album that sounds like Depeche Mode, kind of. <laughs> oh, yeah. Because they always have that kind of like the same feel to their music. Yeah, it's very it's power metal, power melodic metal. Yeah. It's very clean, very melodic. Yeah. <laughs> they still play big shows. Man. Damn, he's got the souped out car now. Yeah. German rap in yeah. Now 
their friends. Yeah. Those are racist. Know, right? <laughs> what happened here? I always hate when videos yeah. end like that. Like, yeah! Fuck, man! Did you see that? Damn, that bitch was hot. Did you just see that? That was the best fucking video of my life! Holy shit! Oh my fuck! Ooh, I just broke my glasses. <laughs> was that a hat you were wearing, or was that the cat? <laughs> hey, you look like the guy from um, Spaceballs, maybe. Mad Max. Oh, Mad Max. <laughs> the Road Warrior, <laughs> Mad Max. <laughs> What I like about this song is like this song could be like someone's trying to take you down or tear you down. You could just be like, no, fuck you. I'm having the best time of my life, man. Fuck you. You know what I mean? It's just a very good feel good song. And yeah, it's very like positive and just, you know, I guess we need that every once in a while. Metal doesn't have to be all evil. Ooh, speaking of Arch Enemy, though, I would like to, we should actually be back to their their new video. Like, I'm not the biggest like new metal fan. You know, I, I'm sorry. I, I like old school stuff. Yeah, me too. I mean, I, I'm getting, I've only gotten to a few of these newer metal bands and like, but that's what's odd to me. Like, new metal to me always ends up sounding like country music where it's it ends up being the same thing over and over again whereas old metal even when they write new songs it's like they just know what they're doing and there's a lot of new metal bands that do capture that classic 80s sound and i think it's because they you know they just that's something they're influenced by just like if you remember in the 80s you had a lot of bands that tried to sound like the 70s because that's what they were influenced by and but you know hey this is um halloween, halloween. it's a good song it's a good solid song Best time. Uh, there's nothing wrong with it i can't complain yeah, i do have to say that the album halloween the self-titled came out last year is to me it was number two of my top 20 lists for 2021 because the album all the way number through two. yeah it's it's a it's a long album there's songs that are like seven minutes eight minutes long but just so good, melodic, just power stuff. I mean, these guys are on top of their game. And and I think they just, the thing about Halloween, there's a little bunch of albums. They had a lot of albums, you know, and but there was a big uh, gap that I haven't really listened to. I have to go back and listen to. But I listened to the past three albums, and it's just they're consistently good. They're just like, they consistently put out good music. In the, in the, and I love the fact that they took in this the old singer instead of saying, let's get rid of the, the guy we've had. No, let's put them both together. Kind of like what Iron Maiden did with uh, Yan Yannick Gers, you know, when Bruce Dickinson and Adrian Smith came back in the band. Instead of getting rid of Yannick, he said, well, let's have three guitar players. <laughs> and, and, yeah, let's have 500 yeah. guitar players. And so they're making it's, it work. And I think he's just he's having these two singers with two different style of vocals. He's got the, got that kind of more gritty kind of voice. And then Michael Keese from the old classic Halloween that we know of from the Halloween video. And, you know, that's... It's, it's a cool thing to do, you know, just to like, hey, let's let's just... Let's enjoy them both yeah. and see how it and goes. And that tour was you know? really big. I remember when they did that reunion tour with the both singers and they were playing massive freaking crowds and festivals and they're still you know, they're still they're 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 one of the top bands, I think, from the eighties that are still kicking ass. Right on. So yeah, that was Halloween, Halloween best time. Let us know what you guys think in the comments below. Make sure you subscribe to our channel. Yeah. If you haven't subscribed, then listen, I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> it's well it just makes me sad. Yeah. I'm going to get sad and I'm going to cry if you guys don't subscribe. Ooh, hey, that rhymes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to cry. Yeah. Subscribe. It'll still be here after we die. <laughs> we missed our calling. We should have been We should have been songwriters, Eric. Yeah. Oh, wait. We, we were. were. Yeah, still am. But <laughs> yeah, at some point. <laughs> Just need an agent. <laughs> I, need a, yeah, I need an agent. Yeah, I need an agent.